happening? There's lots of cars out tonight. Yeah, it should be a good one. Hopefully. <laughs> Probably oh, just jinxed it. Yeah, all the cars are gonna go home now. What's everyone up to? Happy Sunday! Next week will be good too. It's a long week after weather's decent, eh? Yeah. You can't do anything and everything's closed Monday. Yeah, I keep forgetting that next weekend's a long weekend. I just feel like everything's kind of blending together. Hello, John. Non stop rain in Kansas City. That sucks. That's We're doing good, there. Kevin. How are you? We're coming up to some stuff here, so we'll. Uh, Bunch of dodges are gonna fit in right away here. Yeah, and there's a cobra. I missed the cobra. That's the problem is I see a car, I'm like, ooh, I wish I had one of those, and then I do. Then we go get out of storage, and there's too many cars at home, and I'll drive any of them. Yeah. So all I really drive is this. Hi, Howard. What was the weather like in Indiana there, King Nero? Hi, CCTC. What's up, mountains? Mountains out, man. That guy's always busy. Hey, J Rad. Hey, all classics. How's it going? Hey, Ohio Murr. How was your gig last night? Right? It was last night, I think. Oh, <laughs> King Nero. Sunny and clear with a touch of warm, Danny. Oh, maybe like not I'm warm, but just that it's warm. I'm just very conceited, I guess. Yeah, you're kind of full of yourself. I'm very full of myself. No antenna yet. Well, we don't have a radio. No need for an antenna with no radio. That's kind of how I see it. <laughs> <coughs> Editing more video? That's what Dan was doing right before we came out. Who's that? All classics. That guy's hustling, man. Oh, that's good, Murray. I'm glad to hear that. I would love to, like, hear your band live sometime. CCTC, find a cop and ask him to race for pinks. <laughs> you know what? You do that. I'll watch the video. Yeah. <laughs> What's the stuff above Dan's head? Uh, it's headliner. Piece is coming out. <laughs> you know. It's probably most and stuff. Oh, Charles, that's awesome. He says Vincy is going to email you. What do the locals think as you drive down the main drag? Ah, probably just look at a car, look at another car. On Sundays it's no, we just Yeah, we just blend in. in. It's during the week we stand out. Oh, that's awesome, Douglas. Yeah, Thumper was great. Last night was so much fun on the live. Yeah. We had a blasty blast. I really thought you were gonna catch up to those cool cars. Now I'm just showing them nothing. Switch this back around. Sorry. Goodness. Well, the traffic's not really moving around. No, it's pretty steady actually, which is weird. Oh, here we go. Together. Cobra. Hiss. That was the license plate. Hiss. Yeah, it was venomous. Snake, snake. Oh, cool shab. Jay, thanks for popping in, man. Glad you did. What's the person? Hey, William George, how's it going, man? 29 in Camelot. Yeah, today was like a 30 degree day. Today was nice. Yeah, I left the puppies at home. Looks like everyone's going to Princess Alpha, maybe. Yeah, well. I know a couple of people messaged last week asking why we didn't stop and get out, but we're like still on pretty intense lockdown and the tickets are like $1,200. I don't have $1,200. <laughs> Shocking, I know. I had all sorts of money. <coughs> hey, Reverend Rick. Yeah, there's lots of cars out tonight. Lots of road, though. Oh, yeah. Under 
undercover Chevy truck. That's so you know they're, they're looking kind of for us. To. Yeah, we're about like there's a lot of cool cars driving by tonight. This seems like a modern day American graffiti. Oh well, Canadian graffiti, says Joe. <laughs> to Edmonton on the bike. Just turn around and come home. Gas is cheap. <laughs> Where did he come from? Here? That's a long drive. We will, William. Thank you. It is like 8 o'clock right now. Yeah, a little after. Oh, that's cool, Douglas. Yeah, this place was awesome. That thump that we had on we last night. Jai, how's it going, man? I haven't seen Jai in a long time. We've been, uh, we've been cruising the Green Dodge like all day today, running errands and stuff, you guys. It was a very exciting day today because we started opening the pool. We're filling it up. We put the chlorine in, and I'm real excited about it. <laughs> You are pretty easy to please, though. Pull, 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 pull. Yes. Yeah, everyone loves the pool. Who doesn't love the pool? Oh, that was cool. Well, you love it like crazy. Oh, another undercover cap. Man, they're just everywhere. Nothing to see here. Nothing to <laughs> see here. We got a bunch of witnesses saying we're doing nothing wrong, right? Yeah. Love the old cars and trucks. Kick it down from Virginia. Willie's Willie's Wood Booger's Garage. I like that name. <laughs> yeah, exactly, M and D Mermaid Time. Oh hey Nick, how's it going, man? <laughs> Who's Nick? Nick Moore. Oh. I see. Yeah, I am. I bought a pool floaty. I'm gonna go get some more pool pool floaties this week. Oh, look at that. See, like, people are actually out and about tonight, finally. They haven't really been out and around lately. Well, the weather's been so lame. Loved the video earlier today on loading the Challenger, says Terry. Yeah. I'm not working that chunker for a bit. Is, it a, is it a me. challenge? It's definitely challenging my patience. <laughs> oh, there you go. Yeah, that's what we mean right there. 70 Chevelle. Top five cars I want to own. Well, I have one, but own again, I guess. <coughs> Drain the pool for parts storage. I'm going to kick you out of here. Just kidding. <laughs> ah. There's so many. We've oh, already seen so three. Gosh. <coughs> Oh, I'm gonna have to drive extra, extra good. Well, it's, too much fun to work on once. They're definitely looking to pull people over, I think. Yeah, they're not happy tonight, those guys. That's crazy. <laughs> Terry says, hey Dan, those cars do challenge our patience. <laughs> hey, human being play, how's it going, man? This one challenges me more than anything else for some reason. Oh, it's the 47. The backyard. We actually just ran it today a little bit. Gave it a little love today. A brand new Corvette. Oh, Corvette, Corvette. It's going by half, sorry guys. Oh, where's here for you again, King Nero? Where it's cruise night on Saturdays? Man, I, wish we had I feel like I wish cruise night was on Saturdays just because like it's you know it's a school night and we're old. It is a school night. We are old. Oh that's good Frank's garage. I'm glad you got a lot done. Yeah hey 1057. It's a very nice night for a cruise. Oh that's cool all classics. He'll be working on a challenger this week as well. That guy's got dodge skills though. Yeah way better than you. Uh, you're way better than me. I'm Shannon, how's it going? Is that Ford done yet or what? It's been like 12 <laughs> hours. Hi, Granny and Grandpa. Jai. That was rude. Get 
Give him a 30 second kick out. I should. I'm good at it, actually. Give him a timeout. Oh, I don't know how to do it now. Boom. Yeah, Jai, you're getting a timeout for that comment. Boom. <laughs> yeah, I timed him out. <laughs> That's what you get for calling us old. Man, do I ever like 70 Chevelles. That's too nice for you. Yeah. It would never stay that nice. Well, I could never make it that nice in the first place. Yeah. But if you only have one car, I guess you might as well make it nice. <coughs> Garage. I'm off for the next two weeks. Gonna get the poncho rolling. Right on, man. Oh my gosh, Jai. I've got two accounts, winky face. <laughs> wow, I've been bamboozled. <laughs> good old Jai. Yeah, good that Chevelle man. does sound good. Yeah. You are not wrong. The big block car. <laughs> oh, Shannon. <laughs> That's funny, Dan. You have the Challenger done? <laughs> oh, oh, gloves are off. I didn't... <laughs> thought it was a little friendly competition. I misread the situation. <laughs> Auntie Shannon's coming for you. She's got an attitude. I like that. Don't I like, mess. It's like the ice was broken last night. Now she's letting me have it. <laughs> well, somebody else has to. I need a break sometimes. Yeah. I'll just know and yeah, you tag her and I just get an attitude on my phone. Yeah. Dan, do you do your own wheel alignment? Yep. He sure does. That's why I'm steering it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's awesome, Charles. Thanks to you guys. CEL Customs, my company is now open. Uh, we, Thanks for the inspiration. Oh. Nice, Charles. That's great. Good for you, man. Ooh, MG. Well, I can help by doing yeah, absolutely nothing. Yeah, guy driving that MG. You never see that. Must be his dad's. Wild. Who would drive an MG on purpose? If you're under the age of 65. Oh, that guy looked like he was 16. He's still finding himself. He's just getting a taste. Yeah. Look at all this construction, you guys. It's yeah. crazy. Armando, how's it going? Uh, speed limit on this street is 60? 35 mile an hour. Fear old? You don't know old from Shinolia. I don't know what that means, Dale. I'm sorry. Who's Shinolia? Frank, you guys don't cruise in Staten Island? We have a big parking lot in a local park, and we just... Oh, it's going fast. We just hang out in this, on Sunday mornings. 200 cars. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, we don't have any like cars like that here, which I actually rather go in the mornings. Yeah, because like, Sunday just, morning cruise would be way nicer. Yeah, like a whole day night. still for you. Yeah. Well, we were giving her all day. We still got to go home and like eat. And... Yeah, we were out lots, like all day today doing stuff. Yeah, we truly. Really, uh... Oh, Shinola. I get it. <laughs> <laughs> Apartment buildings and torn up roads. When did you guys move to Russia? <laughs> well, we like the vodka. We eat a lot of potato. It's good here. It's good in Russia. You know, what if big roads are rough, eh? Hey? Vegas does have nice roads. It's fine. Hey, Musashi, how's it going, man? Oh, you guys like the sun. Are we all going to have like a romantic sunset cruise together? It's got a real Lion King vibe to it. Everything the light touches is ours. Everything else is Transcona. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> well, you might have a few enemies there. Shannon, <laughs> stop and get a burger. She gave $25. Get a burger. We, well, we have to now. 
mean, didn't we do that last year? We would we would go through the drive through in whatever car we were in. Yeah, we took a stupid vote on what we eat for McDonald's. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Does Dan let you drive, Danny? Yes, Jai. But I only really like to drive my car. She can drive whatever she wants. I can drive whatever I want. I have free reign. Everything's insured. Does Winnipeg have any classic type drive-ins? Not really. There's some that are sort of classic-y style drive-ins um, out of town. So we're going to go um, <coughs> this summer. We want to go to a few places. Test out some ice creams. Okay. Huh? We want to go test out some ice creams. Some places. Hey, somebody's going to do it. Might as well be us. Might as well be us. You mean like drive-in movies or drive-in like diners? I'm just thinking drive-in diners. Oh, Dale just did a loop of Princess Auto and says it's pretty busy right now. So, well maybe we'll drive through. You know what that pose and hey, look who's there. That's a penny boy. <laughs> a lone penny boy. That's a spotted out in the wilderness. You never see him alone. A lone penny boy. Majestic, fearsome, beautiful. You don't often see a lone penny boy. They usually travel with packs. <laughs> I got really sidetracked. <laughs> Go to Coes and Headingley. Yeah, I heard that that place is pretty good. We've never been there. Have you been there? I've never been there. What's it called? Coes and Headingley. That ice cream stand. It's a really nice night, you guys. Like this has been, this is probably the nicest night we've had in a long time. Well, it's been a good day, and I really do. Yeah. Hi, Rick. How's it going? <laughs> you know what? There's no maple syrup in the glove box. And actually, I don't know that Dan likes Vegemite. I don't mind Vegemite. Dan, I don't think would like it. You know what, today Ken had actually gone up to like 30 degrees. Right now I'd say it's probably still like 25. It's windy though. It's very windy. It's really messing with my hair. All that time I spent brushing and stuff. <laughs> All the time you spent brushing? Well that one time. Do you even own a brush? You know I have the brush. Two brushes. Oh, that's cool, us butters. Give us a honk if you drive by. Woo, boom fast, boom fast. Ah, uh, Kenneth. Well, we're glad that you're here. Which car do you want, Shannon? Not this one. <laughs> Hello, John. How's it going? Yeah, how's the uh, how's the quality tonight? Is it doing okay? You know, a, a few people last week were saying it was kind of like we were underwater, but Dan needs to host a drive night once COVID is clear. I don't want to host it, but show up. Yeah. Somebody else wants Somebody to do else all the work. Somebody else plans it, yeah. and uh, we'll be there. Yeah, I'll do nothing. <laughs> Shannon would like the wagon or satellite. Oh yeah. She might as well just come drive. <laughs> the satellite's a bit of a runner. Wagon's a little, a little iffy right now, but it'll get there. It's getting there. Yeah. Shannon said she'll raise you for cash. <laughs> Has she seen our bank account? <laughs> <laughs> You'd have to put up both sides of the money. Yeah, you'd be winning your own back. <laughs> We're hoping for power tours still, but we'll we'll see what the border has to say. Oh, that's good. People are saying it looks good and it sounds good. There are lots of people here. Yeah.
Look at these fun VWs. Cute. Wagon. That's cool, man. Very cute. Volkswagen people. I'd like to be a Volkswagen person. What's that? I'd like to be a Volkswagen person. You gotta dress differently. Well, you're part way there with your hair. I don't think. Well, wow. are Volkswagen people hippies? What is a GT boutique? It is uh, kind of like a Walmart. Oh, like literally kit. <laughs> That's fun. <laughs> I never watched that show though. Really? Yeah. You're missing out. Uh, All sorts of stuff in here, mate. Lots. I like it. Lots of people out. Nice to see. What? Uh, it's actually a nice wagon, drive by wagon there one to get it. Drive by it. <clears throat> oh look at that! <laughs> what are we at? I don't know what this is, but I like it. <laughs> it's wild. The sun is <laughs> yeah, the sun is crazy. I keep not being able to read the comments. So yeah, sorry! Driving by feel right now. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> well, it's a nice international. Hopefully not. <laughs> Turlo, a Jeep! Of course you'd be excited about a Jeep. <laughs> Why wouldn't you be? I like him. He gets it. <laughs> of course I would. Alright, make a loop in here and then we're out of here. Cause... Yeah, we're not brave enough for... Uh... Oh, it'd be weird to talk to. Walk around with it. Yeah. And we're on our face while we're walking. That would be very Aqua Taco. It's already weird. It is very weird. But you know, looks good. Lots to see. I suppose it's a wagon. I love this wagon. It is super nice. Like, it is beyond nice. <laughs> This wagon's cool too. This is the guy who got those uh, seats off of and stuff. Oh yeah, yeah. The Beaumont wagon, LS power and stuff. It's really nice. Really, That's really super nice. cool. Yeah, lots of cool cars out tonight. Sorry, you guys. I completely ignored all your comments. <laughs> My bad. It's just like being in a relationship together. I don't ignore you. <laughs> on Tuesdays. Phase me in and out here and there. Sometimes you need to be phased in and out. Sometimes I need a break. <laughs> right. Man, this is a uh, rough traffic here. Sorry. These people are gonna let me in. Good nice. Friendly Manitoba. Friendliest of Manitobas. That was way cool. It's nice to see. <laughs> right on! <laughs> that was pretty good. It was actually just good seeing people out and about. Cars. Yeah, very good to see people out and about for sure. It drives me nuts how there's been nothing going on so long. I'll do a little cruise downtown now when it gets a little darker. Yeah. I mean, it looks like tons of people were still piling in there. We could always drive by again and see, but... This thing hasn't let us down? No. That's always a nice change. Oh, look at that. Yeah, once COVID is also, like, kind of the borders are open and stuff, we'd love to kind of find, a like, a central space where maybe people could meet where we could all get together. Oh, I want to do just like a, like straight up road trip, make like a map, do our own yeah. thing. We're going to be here, 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 and just like stay at people's houses. Yeah. Yeah. Auntie Shannon, we're coming. Yeah, yeah. Auntie Shannon, uh, Terry, Tracy, Terry from last night. Yeah. Their whole crew. We'll go stay with Uncle Tony. Whoever will have us. Yeah, whoever will have us, we'll come stay. Whoever's going to give us dinner. <laughs> Shannon says, come on. 
<laughs> Did you see her accent? I'd imagine so. Bye, James. Smuggled some car parts to you. <laughs> oh, I'd have a trunk load of car parts coming home. Lots of folks are saying we could go stay with them. People are too <laughs> trusting. Cake Town set up a GoFundMe for gas. <laughs> <laughs> it's only money. Oh, that sucks, Kevin, to have to put off fishing and stuff. Yeah, yeah. unfortunately, lots happening all the time for people. Oh, well, as long as we can, we'll power through and we'll all be back together again. Come on down to Texas, says Joey. I wish Texas wasn't so far away. Because I would like to go to Texas. <laughs> Adopt a DD speed shop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Nathan says come to my place in Arizona. We have a nice 57 project. Oh, yeah? Well, you don't got to twist my arm too hard to go do that. Shannon says, got an acre fenced in and a pool, bring the dogs. <laughs> and two garages for Dan. <laughs> Are we yeah. living there or visiting? I'm confused. <laughs> Obviously we're moving there. What's up, Nova guy? <laughs> Our Sprocket says, the car is too quiet. It's super quiet. Murray the other day said that I pulled up to borrow a tool and he's like, I didn't even hear you pull up, he says. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. I really like those Corvettes. I'd like one. Corvette, Corvette. He's got like more power, more air conditioning. Jai says to come work on my Falcon. Jai, have you done anything of that yet? <laughs> Johnny B, any plans to visit <laughs> to visit old zip ties? Oh yeah. I think we go down there this summer and see what he's up to. Hi Mike. Yeah, I'd like to go to that big swap meet in Carlisle. Yeah. Shade Tree Mechanic Racing will sponsor our immigration. Oh yeah? Yeah. <laughs> who, who has to marry him? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, if I gotta do it, I gotta do it. Nathan has uh, two spare bedrooms. <laughs> STL Tony says that you're too tall for a vet. <laughs> really? No way. I'm not that tall. You gotta be able to fit those new ones. Larry Gardner, just sitting in my recliner riding with you guys and remembering when this was impossible. Isn't this crazy that we can all like go on a cruise together like this? It is wild. The internet is a crazy thing. Every day I just can't, I can't believe anybody has any interest in what I'm doing in the garage for any reason. <laughs> like, I'm in sandals and jorts. Yeah, it's jorts guys. Jorts got brought up today. Welding on some pile of junk car and that's awesome. It's relatable. I love it. It's pretty incredible that we've gotten to connect with all of these peoples. All of these people, yeah. It is cool. Car is sounding good. It's weird to be in a car that's not super noisy, that I feel like is very dependable. I always worry it's stalled, you know, and we're just coasting. Yeah. It's like, did it die? <laughs> So I got a crank it? All Classic says, oh my, not the jorts. <laughs> Come on. He's a jorts guy. He must be. Doug liked the white Camaro we passed. Yeah, that thing looked nice. Guaranteed that guy bought that thing brand new. <laughs> He's had it since day one. Bought it in high school. What? I didn't say anything. It is windy here, eh? It is windy on this whole stretch. Well, side to side wind is crazy. That's where these bed windows are good. <laughs> Triple B says proper attire for a cruise. <laughs> yeah, Larry, we try to get to kind of everyone in the comments. Sometimes it goes really fast if we can, but I'm a quick reader and I'm a fast talker. Don't believe her BS. She picks favorites. <laughs> Danny, remind oh. Dan to stop in at the dollar store to get the Plymouth Challenger parts. What the dollar store? I wish it was at the dollar store. Wouldn't that be nice? I might as well go to the Fort Knox. It costs so much money. Bye, Jai. Later, buddy. Oh, Jeff McKenzie. Hey, guys, I picked thing. up a... What? Where? I missed it. 
You are terrible. Well, I'm just reading a comment. Hey guys, I picked up an 80 Firebird today. Another excuse to put off the 57 Chevy, says Jeff. <laughs> Come on, man. Get on the 57. I'll go on this link so we watch the traffic uh, yeah. coming against us. There's always cool stuff. Fire of the Greeks. I'm worried that left arm is going to get too much sun and almost get a suntan. <laughs> Fire of the Greeks said that about you. Oh, my left arm is always more tan than my right it's arm. It's very awkward. Whatever. <coughs> the Plymouth is a really nice cruising car there, Nathan. You got that right. This thing is a really nice car. Like, it's just easy. It did fight pretty hard, so I feel like we're owing a little bit of ease. <laughs> Yeah. 
really take advantage of it. Oh, look at all this. What? There's just lots of cool cars. On the 57-150, you should put a 409 W engine for a big block Black Widow. That would be awesome. Slightly out of my price range. <laughs> older Winnipeg neighborhoods that are kitschy and cool. Um, you know what? There are some really neat old neighborhoods. I think I'd probably maybe just do an actual video of that. That's a good idea. I'm going to steal that. Thanks. That'd be a good video. You could do is drive through like Wolseley yeah. and stuff like that. It'd be pretty easy to build. Yeah, Manitoba land of 100,000 lakes. Is that Ontario? I don't know. I'm not a doctor. <laughs> you can't just read things and say I think I that. can. No, I, mean, I absolutely can't do that. Whether they choose to believe me or not is up to them. You definitely can and you definitely did. I'll give you that <laughs> Can't find 409s anymore. Believe me. I've been looking forever, says TH Man. I think all you gotta do is spend more money and then you can find anything. All of a sudden, if your budget goes up... Everything's available if you pull out the visa. <laughs> I think the days of deals are gone, but... Frank's Garage says it's on a Manitoba plate. No, it's on a, it's on a Ontario plate, Thousand Lakes, isn't it? I don't know, but that guy's rocking out of his car and I like it. Oh, it's very flat here, Timothy. We're right, we're in like the flattest part of Canada. Like, there ain't no mountains here, there's not really hills. There is like a desert, which is kind of neat, but that's about it. Be flat. <laughs> Be flat. Yes, Franks, please email a photo of the plate. Let us prove him wrong. Yeah, Vegas has nice roads because they don't have snow. Accurate. We have no mountains nearby. Like well, even North Dakota has nice roads, and they're they have the same weather as us. Oh, Nova. Yeah. Thumper, your dog takes off running and you can see him three days later, but he's real small. Yeah. <laughs> Accurate. <laughs> Sprockets, vroom, vroom, vroom. <laughs> I like it when you guys make the motor noises. Is there a head? Is there a crazy? Just type them out. I'll interpret them. An interpretive vrooming. An interpretive vrooming. <laughs> Julie, do you want to race my 1970 Plum Crazy Purple Hemi 426 Cuda, Dan? Sure. <laughs> I don't have to win, right? <laughs> Racing's easy. Winning is hard. <laughs> Charles. <laughs> <coughs> Number one says... Thumper, I'm going to talk to my Mopar nut brothers and see if we can adopt you two. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if we fit in. We're in and out of Mopars like crazy. Yeah, we're mixing it up too much. Yeah. As we've been driving these Dodges too much, I, mean, I should get the 55 going. We'll drive that next week or something like yeah, that. Yeah, that'd be nice. That's always a good one for this. Yeah. These little carburetors taking apart and stuff. Try Arizona heat gets melting the yeah. roads. Thumper, I'm a Pontiac man. You fit. <laughs> Aw, thanks, Timothy. Well, we're glad that you could be here with us. There's Ed. Oh, an HRA stock. Except we're on a place where we can't really do turns. Yeah. I like to go through his GTO. Probably headed to Princess Auto out of some. Wow, you're being the person we hate so much right now. <laughs> Am I? Oh, I thought you were going to turn here and turn I around. I was just cop right there, so we'll see. We'll go yeah. the next one. Yeah. Go up and around. <laughs> You're being the person we hate. We're not that bad. We're a bit of a pain. Rick says this car is nice and quiet, easy to hear y'all talk. <laughs> Sprockets, I missed the breakdown. <laughs> Don't jinx it, man. Sprockets, are you onside or offside? 
This thing, it, this could easily turn from a live drive to a live fix, what you know it. <laughs> to a live taxi ride home. I guess we've got a flat deck, we could just be on the back and like sit in the car while he drives us. And... He always uses his turn signal. That is true. I very rarely use my turn signals. What? I thought you always use them. No. I know, the fender blinkers are very neat. downtown than they are whatever. <laughs> we know sprockets, we know. But he's trying to get to us, he's winning? Yeah. Oh, Shannon found an eyebrow today and some handles in those boxes. Oh. <coughs> you should say try five stuff so it doesn't sound so creepy. <laughs> <laughs> couple eyebrows. That's weird. <laughs> she might be hoarding eyebrows. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Do you uh, haul tools for roadside repair? Uh, there's a screwdriver in here, I think. So we're set. That's all we have. Yeah, we got cell phones. You know what? I will say having, like, these Plymouths, these are probably the most comfortable after my car. They're very comfortable. I The seats in the 55, like, wreck my back. Well, yeah, but the seats that are in your car are supposed to be in the 55. That's not my problem. <laughs> it's my problem, I know. Yeah, exactly. You know, in all classics, we went and checked yesterday and there was nothing. So they might just not have put like the the card in our P.O. box yet. So we'll go check again this week a couple times. It's a times. paint on weekends, the P.O. Yeah. box is talking? Yeah. They're usually, the girl I like works Monday to Friday. She's good. Good girl. That girl with red hair? She oh, yeah, she is good. She just, like... Well, she's, like, the manager, I think, of that post box. She's just, like, here's all your stuff. I'm like, thanks. And it's, like, she'll, like, bump the line and everything. She's yeah. super nice. Are you guys planning on getting out to Alberta driving? Yeah, I'd like to. Oh, Let's Bandit wants to know where the 57 is tonight. Which one? Yours? I'd assume so. She's at home, yeah. Just at home. We took that last time, right? Last weekend? Yeah, Nathan, we usually have like lots of car shows like on Saturdays and Sundays, but with all the restrictions right now, they're not allowed to happen. So this is the best we can do for now. It's also weird filming actually at car shows though. I yeah, think. I don't, I feel like I feel very uncomfortable. You need to get like a, like a, like a body cam like a cop would have so you don't even you forget it's there. <coughs> And they just edit it up later or something. Well, that's cool, Nova guy. We have a cruise on Friday and the cops joined us. That's neat. Some places the cops are right in on it. A screwdriver, crescent wrench, and a hammer, and you can fix anything. Oh yeah, and duct tape. I've got, yeah, I've got a flathead. And, oh, there's another one. Two flatheads. And I got a Leatherman. Julie says, Dan, are you two chicken erase my Cuda? No. I'm just not guaranteeing I'm gonna win or it's gonna make it or not overheat or any of those things. Oh, Timothy, that's nice of you. I think that one of the biggest attractions to your channel is the good humor you both maintain even when facing challenges. Thanks, buddy. Did you finally fix the thump in the front end in the trunk? No. <laughs> <laughs> I did none of that. Hard no. <laughs> Oh man, Frank's, he is obsessed with that Leatherman. Oh my gosh. Oh, I hope Frankie's not chewing up things. Did you close the bathroom door? You were the last one out. Oh boy. You, well, who doesn't have a Leatherman? I use my Leatherman every day, like without fail. That guy's in a hurry. That was loud. That's like, I wonder, have you not seen the cops? Are we just seeing them? Like, what's going on here? Like, <laughs> Are they even real? Or what real? The cops. Maybe they're just in our head. You think we're both tripping out, man? Might be.
Micra has been a lifesaver for me many times, says CCTC. Oh, man. The Micra, I don't even know what that one is, but I'm telling you. If you don't have a leather in here, you're missing out in life. Do your wipers work? Yeah. Why? Somebody asked. Well, they don't, they don't think I could get the wipers running? <laughs> The wipers will do our nightmare. <laughs> do a burnout and see if the pretty lights turn on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good, thanks. McDonald's, get some nuggies. How's from Turlo? Turlo. I do love nuggies. <laughs> Body by chicken nuggets. <laughs> They're pretty simple, eh? <laughs> yeah. As long as you're happy, that's all that matters. I'm very happy. Oh, Johnny says that the Swiss Army knife is way better. No. I've actually never had a Swiss Army knife. I you don't need... Uh, oh, Murr says you don't need tools when you got Murr on speed dial. What? Murr, are you going to come out and help us out? Pizza and a milkshake. I've never had pizza and a milkshake. That seems like an interesting combination. A milkshake does sound good, though. Yeah. <laughs> All classics. Nuggy times. There are still some uh, squeaks in here, David. They're not all gone. It must be on their end. I don't hear anything. It must be your internet connection. There's no way there's a squeak in this. All of that fine is squeaks. Actually, someone said, like, I don't even think I bolted in the back seat. I literally just tossed it in there. Ah. So that's probably, like, one of my Could be the issues. cause. Yeah, I'm definitely thinking that. Could uh, you and Peg drag race sometime? <clears throat> well, I think I would win that one. These old junky IDI trucks. Holy moly, TH man, for reals? He almost got carjacked getting his cutlass out of storage. Sounds like you left me in a nice area. Hi, BW. What's BW up to? There are 16 Burger Kings in Kuwait City. Why not? There's. A, we just passed a Burger King. Also, isn't Burger King disgusting? We don't have a lot of Burger Kings here, I don't think. Yeah. In Kuwait City? Apparently. That's a lot of yeah. Burger Kings. Yeah, Stan, it's a very nice evening. Yeah, but on Fremont, where I remember that. 
Is it like at a hotel or is it? Uh... <coughs> Good night, Shannon. Thanks for coming by. Hi, Shannon. Oh, Kevin, you too. Thanks for coming and hanging out. What's a smash burger, BW? I feel like the state says burgers under control better than we do. Oh, now I'm hungry for so many different things. I want like a milkshake, and I want a delicious burger, and I want pizza, and I want... <laughs> I feel like talking about food when we're hungry and don't know what we're going to eat. It really is not a good idea. Just a real healthy afternoon. Just so healthy. Everything always reverts to food. This is why we eat guests on the channel. <laughs> we like food, <laughs> and it shows. <laughs> Bodies buy food. Look at this dog just walking with the guy without even a leash. Wow, well, that's, that's a, good a good dog. Oh no, he's got a leash. I just can't see it. <laughs> well, can you see it? I love Fremont Street. We have blast. Like Vegas is one of my favorite places to go. Like I could go every. Well, usually we do go every year. I want to go with a hot rod. That'd be fun. I like that'd be way cooler. Mm. That would be super fun. Me too. 
<laughs> Timothy. All the food talk, I had to grab a Hagen Dazs. Hagen Dazs? Ice cream? Bye, Mr. Sh uh, Chevy truck. Thanks Later, for popping buddy. in. How nice the sunset is. The sunset is real. We have very pretty sunsets here. Like, our sunset game is on point. <laughs> hey! <laughs> <laughs> There's some little hot rods on this side. No, I've got the camera angled. Are you angled? Yeah. Oh, my bad. No. Goodness gracious. The goodness gracious. <coughs> yeah, Thumper, we're glad you came on. We had a blast. Well, I got a little jealous with old Thumper there. It's pretty good. It's gonna be okay. Yeah, I'm still. Hey, Manster. Well, the Challenger currently is not drivable, I also think it'd be crazy loud. It's not that bad. It's got muffs on it. Oh, yeah. Everybody's leaving PA. All of those cars are gone. Here's just a little shift change. It's a fine Chevy truck. Get the boat out. Yeah. We need a guy on the inside. Was this thing was battery my phone has? It was kind of empty. Oh. Uh, 29%. Oh, so lots. We're good. Hi, Ed from Macomb, Michigan. Macomb. Macomb. I've heard good things. I'm a Chrysler retiree. Love your Mopar. Chrysler, like he worked at Chrysler, or he used to be a Chrysler guy. Now he's he's a Chevy guy or something. I don't know. Maybe he'll answer. <laughs> Never call it rust. Call it Great Northern Patina. I hate rust. Thank God, do we have a lot of it? Your eyes are very blue. Look at the camera again. Wow, so handsome. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we can see the northern. <laughs> Pardon me, sorry, the northern lights. Wasn't there supposed to be some Northern Lights this week or last week? I think it was two weeks ago. Oh. That's what I wanted to see it, but I never did. <coughs> oh well. Sorry guys, I forgot to bring water with me. When I talk a lot, I just get very dry in the throat. Oh, thanks, CD. We're glad that you could be riding with us too. Oh, Ed worked in the Chrysler. Race group for 42 years at oh, Chrysler that Engineering. Oh, that's cool. That's very cool. And now he's retired. Huh? Thumper, I'm far enough north. I've seen the Northern Lights in July. Really? That's cool. How has the sparkly Mopar been running? Good. <laughs> if only I would just, just stop hitting the mirror. It, yeah. Can't help it. What? <laughs> I keep smacking everything. It's probably annoying for them. They're sorry, like, everybody. Happening? Are you sorry, though? I am, I think. I am, I think. Second of all, I wish we could play. How badass would videos be if you could play like actual music, like rock and roll and like classic rock? Oh, but those man. licenses are expensive to buy. Oh yeah, never in a million years could we afford that. But... That'd be super cool. Oh, Turlo, there's another Jeep for you. Turlo's a bit weirdo with the Jeep life, eh? I like it. Slower down, eh? Slower down? Slower down. Well, as slow as we can go. Well, a lot of 
do stuff here. I feel, oh, watch out. I feel like if we were to go, oh yeah, we'd get like 18 calls. <laughs> you think so? Absolutely I do. <laughs> this is the crowd for that. Yeah, this is, this is truck club and all that, I guess. Huh? Yeah, truck club scares me. They're really cool. Why? Because they're really cool. And oh, because they're young. We're a losers. We are losers. <laughs> When did that happen? When did we become uncool? We turned 30. <laughs> Man, 30 is tough like that there, right? Oh, there's that GTO. <laughs> a giant tiger is kind of like a Walmart, but less Walmart-y. <laughs> We're going to park beside Ed and look at his car real quick, so okay? Yeah. Smash! <laughs> yeah. I don't want to get too close. Take it off the thing, whatever. Or everyone do. All right, bear with me. Ed, what's your channel again? It's NHRA Stock, right? So this is Ed's car, and you guys see Ed in the chat on Saturday nights all the time. Oh, we're still on the air? We are. Yeah, I just wanted to pop in for a minute and take a look at this thing before we head home. This thing is super, super clean. He takes on drag weed and beats on it and all sorts of things, so... I like it. This thing is so nice. It folds the quarter pedal in every now and again, no big deal. Like, yeah, goodness. So permanent dent in there now. You just have to accept those dents and then carry on with life. Oh, I know, that's a lot of people tell me it's a battle scar. <laughs> How long have you had this thing for? Uh, since 1983. Holy! Oh, and David Hearn says that he's met you before at Drag Week. Oh, cool. <laughs> David was on two weeks ago uh, on uh, the chat. Oh, I was in the shop two weeks ago, so I just wasn't with you guys. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. How does she smell? It smells clean. <laughs> like an empty bank account, I think is what it smells like. Yeah. yeah, this is a completely different tax bracket from your cars. <laughs> I'm not even offended because yeah. I know. Wow, this thing is gorgeous. Wow. Well, Very you like nice. it back of the road? Yeah. I don't know how interesting this is for people on the street there. But the street people really like person. it though. You're getting a lot of a lot of compliments, Ed. Ah, uh, that un unmistakable GTO aroma, someone has said. Well, Smells like races. horsepower. We gotta get together and do something. Trade in the Plymouth straight across. <laughs> <laughs> I think it'd be the Plymouth and the house and everything yeah. in it, and we'd have a chance. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. Okay. It's good to meet you, man. Nice Likewise. to meet you. <laughs> See you guys. See you later. Well, I feel like I've already broken the seal, and now I just want to be with people. <laughs> I'm hungry for dinner. Michael just asked, can we race? Ooh, I do have my mask. I was sitting on it. That's so smart of you. All right, now we'll start hot. Oh, yeah. <coughs> we did it. It's not even that bad, man. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Oh, right on, man. Hey, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Come on, the fender, the fender's not that bad. It just, <laughs> it, it, the rest of the car just looks a little too nice. That's the problem. I'll put, I'll dent this one for you so they match. A little symmetry is the problem, maybe. Eh? Hey, James, <laughs> how's it going, man? Later, man. That was cool. Probably oh, this cool. really makes me miss being able to like get out and walk around and like have a life. Yeah. Yeah, it was good times. It's your night, Dan. It started hot. 
Yeah, it is. I'm shocked, actually. <laughs> Lie, Rick says, don't fix the fender. <laughs> you don't gotta twist my arm too hard there. Man, there's a lot of traffic here. Yeah, the scoping is gonna be a real... Uh, we may have pulled into a poor, uh, poor, spot. poor parking spot. Well, well we can just watch everything go by. Ah. Uh, watch our life go by? Yeah, another Plymouth, Plymouth ladies and gentlemen. Dan does clean up nice. <laughs> I'm grubby AF right now. <laughs> what's uh, this guy's letting this guy go and it's. Well, he's driving I don't know what's here. happening here. Kinda... Right, get out of here. Yeah. <laughs> Make sure you guys go check out Ed's channel, NHRA Stock. Ed's a good dude. I like him. He's a great dude. I thought we were talking for like two hours the other on the phone. Yeah, we. And we never this met him. This is the first time we got to meet him. <laughs> it was cool. Yeah. This Man, has been a that, good weekend for that. That car has a so gorgeous. Oh my gosh! I like. I didn't even want to be near it. <laughs> I, I was so I, afraid. I was saying I'm like, oh. like right here. I'm like, oh god. <laughs> Of all the times that the, you know something like the wheel just falls off. Jeez, and right? Oh, that guy's running a dead flat tire. Uh oh. And it's a Kia. Does that sound familiar? Remember that time you you drove right into work on two dead flat tires and I had to fix them? For I didn't you? drive into work. I drove right into your work actually. That's what I mean, my work. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah I did that. <laughs> you drove to work, and then did you take my car? Uh, no, I just walked across the street. And just just left it with me and I had two two tires. Yeah, I got two new tires for free from you. Well, they weren't free. Well, for free for me, you bought them. Yeah. <laughs> the yeah, triple B nice cars make me nervous. <laughs> well, I have such an appreciation for nice cars and nice paint and all that, but I just don't think I have it in me. Can't believe all the fans yesterday. Most have an acreage. Unbelievably awesome. What a great show yesterday, says Rick. Yeah. I really hope that takes off and we get more and more people in on doing it. I mean, hopefully, we, we actually have a bunch of ideas we want to do with that. Like, we got to figure out time zones because that was something where we had people waiting because we were just doing order whoever joined first. Yeah. But then also by the time we got to them, like, uh, what's her name and everything? Like, like how, we should have got to them earlier. Yeah. They were on for a while. And they had so much to show us. So we'll yeah. be, we're still working out the kinks, but we'll get there. Is there a way we could have it where it's like it says their name we get, and they can have their time Yeah, they or could put like their that. time in there or their time zone. Or we could do like a Google Sheet where people can kind of sign up. I don't think. But no that's one's a lot of work. Beforehand. Come on, let's be honest. <laughs> They're gonna, they can barely click the button like me, some of them people. <laughs> they couldn't turn their phone sideways. <clears throat> well, it's been an hour of this. An hour of An this. hour, are you hungry or are we doing one yeah. more drive down the... Yeah, we'll just kind of go up to like a little bit more as it gets dark and then we'll uh, shut her down. Unless they want to see something or do something or whatever or what? Yeah. Any requests? Any requests? We got headlights on. Yeah, I mean, we truly could keep just going. It was warm today and ran good. Uh, so. This thing probably had like 100 miles put on today between. Oh, screw it. We went out twice to do a bunch of errands. <laughs> Mark, hands off, man. Oh my lord, he is so cute. Reminds me of my ex. Mark? Yeah. Whatever. If you want to take care of me, I mean, I'm into it. <laughs> I want to be a kept man. It ain't going to happen with me, I'll tell you that much. Why? Oh, thanks, Mark. I am lucky. Are you? I'm very lucky. I believe the world word, as my mother would say, Miss Danny, you're spoiled. With a T. You are spoiled. With a T is key. Spoiled. Why does that mean? That's just how Caribbean people say it. Spoiled. So something spoiled rotten? Well, it's spoiled rotten, but I'm spoiled. Yeah, yeah. 
<laughs> Howard, thanks for coming and hanging out, man. It's good to see us. <coughs> it was good to read you, yeah, sort of things. We don't have to get to Oh, see yeah, it. I guess it was good to read you. That sounds stupid, though. I just make up whatever what I think everybody looks like in my head. How's that work out for you? Pretty good, I think. I Mostly gotta, everyone's smoking hot. I mean, this is a compliment. When we were doing those things the last couple nights, we were seeing people. Y'all looked a lot better than I thought you would. <laughs> I, I was like, how is this going to go? I'm thinking, like, we're going to get people like me just dirty and greasy and can't figure out phones and all. People just figured it out. They're using, like, flashlights and all. I mean, that was... Yeah, you guys had, like, a good system happening there. Yeah, Franks, so I feel like you're probably not going to be going on a cruise for a while. <laughs> You should cruise the old part of downtown sometime. Well, I think it was number one had a really good idea of kind of showing off some of the old neighborhoods. So I think I'll do that in a video for you guys. We should do some like landmarks and stuff. Yeah. Like Manitoba or Winnipeg landmarks. Yeah, we'll do that. That sounds super fun. You can even just do that like the end of videos even, you know, like do a video and then edit those in oh, if you yeah. wanted to. And then like, I think if you did one video, it'd be a little weird, you know? But if you did something, it'd be like, and today we're just gonna take a look at this road. Yeah. Or start a video that way. Yeah. <laughs> Lloyd, it went pretty darn good last night for only your second time. Thanks, man. We learned a lot from the first one. Yeah. You guys were super patient, and last night went fantastic, I thought. I couldn't believe how many of y'all were like patiently waiting for us in that little waiting area. It's not that bad though, they can still watch. Yeah. So it's not, like, but it's still, terrible, like. But yeah. No, I know what you mean. That was that was really cool. We gotta get like, what I, I was telling Danny, what I really want to see, because after the fact, I got like a bunch of you guys sent emails, which is awesome, I, and like pictures of your shops and stuff like that, and I was like, I got after the <coughs> jealousy ran its course, I was like, <laughs> that'd be cool if we could set it up and do like two or three people or see like their shop and their, I, I'm a little partial right now because I'm like, we're thinking about building a shop or whatever, or if we can't, or setting up a shop if we get a house that already has one. And just to see what everyone else has already done and what works and what doesn't yeah. work. It'd be cool to see, you know, what's all out there and stuff. Because people like, there's a guy there yesterday, he had like a second story and he had so much artwork all over the walls. Like, oh, cool. Oh, so cool. One guy had a bunch of like uh, die cast cars and like Hot Wheels and stuff. I mean, I don't know, I thought that was all super neat. Yeah, the more you see other people set up, it helps you design yours. Yeah, well, and I mean, and the other thing, like, you know, I don't want to overthink it. Like, if you have, like, a blank slate, you're like, oh, I need, I need do, this, well, I need this. Well, the imagination almost runs away from you, yeah. right? Like, of what's, like, actual, realistic, and, like, necessary for you. Well, and I mean, like, I know everyone's like, oh, I need, like, a, a 40 by 80 shop and all these things and all this and that. And you know what? That would be awesome. Don't get me wrong. But would I accomplish in a... 20 by 22 like if, if we just had twice the garage with like two foot taller ceilings or something like that it would be like a world of difference so, yeah i mean i don't think it has to be absolutely just showstopper crazy and i and i kind of want to do that even and like make a video series off here where you build a shop and be like how you can get the most out of things yeah on a, and how to like set it up in a way that makes yeah. sense the big thing is lighting. I'd like to have the lighting different because I struggle with lighting in that garage all the time. Yeah, well, King Mira, we usually, now that it's summer, I think we're going to try to do, like, the live drive every Sunday because that's our cruise night. But it'll kind of get later and later as um, as summer goes on just because it starts later because of the sun and stuff. Like, I feel like we actually probably could have started at, like, 8.30 or something tonight. Yeah. Instead of 8.00. This is my favorite time when the sun's just kind of going down. Oh, cute! Oh my gosh. Uh, nice thing is there's a cop there. He's getting pulled over for us, so we're good. <laughs> we're like totally We hope so. Game. But like, cool car, man. We love you. <laughs> I love that thing. Oh, I would we just, that. We, we'd rather it be you than us. <laughs> I'm like, I'm pretty sure that's illegal. I think you have to have some sort of covering on it. I like the little flapper. That's cool. Oh. See, we need a friend that has one of those so we can just drive just it. borrow it and go have fun for yeah, a day. For like a weekend and then like give it back and be like, sorry we broke it, we'll see you later. 
more junk equals less money because more space equals more junk. Yeah. Has been a common statement. <laughs> well, the last thing I want to be is like have like all this property and big shop and all that, and then I can't afford any cars anymore. So, I don't know. It's a daily talk we have, I think. Yeah. Like, never ends. A bug would be better than a gremlin. <sighs> I feel like they're very equal in my books. Yeah, they are pretty cool. Well, time to shut her down, go get some McDonald's or what? I think so. All right, friends. It's always a pleasure. Thanks for hanging out with us, like usual. We had a blast. I'm hoping we're gonna have uh, a guest next week on the uh, on the chat. So I don't know if we'll still do people in or not. I guess we gotta talk to. We'll talk that one out or whatever. I know there's a lot of people we wanted to get to and stuff like that. Maybe we, we gotta figure some way out. I love looking at your guys' stuff forever. So don't feel you know shy or whatever. If you guys got good internet, and decent lighting, I don't care what it is. I'd like to look at it. Bikes or motorcycles yeah. or. Trains. If you make cool art, yeah. like, we want to see what you're doing. I love someone who's, who's passionate who, yeah, about what they're doing. I don't care if it's buttons or sewing machines. If you're, like, it's your jam, I want to see it. Because I just think that's so <laughs> awesome. And like, you talking about it just makes it the best. Like, I am addicted to cars, and I know I am. And I just, like, if someone has that same passion for whatever, I love it. I think that's so awesome. So, whatever it is, let us know, and... We'll see you next weekend, right? Yeah. Right on, guys. Bye, friends. Bye.